Greetings folks, it's Sarah with Obadiahs. Today I want to do temperature readings for you guys on the Drolet 1800 Escape wood stove. Now typically I'll do temperature readings on wood cook stoves and the baking ovens, etc. Um, but more and more people are looking to become self-sustainable and have a way to cook and feed their family in the event of a power outage. So because I have so many questions on cooking on regular wood stoves, um, I just wanted to do a video to give you guys some temperature readings throughout the first burn so you have an idea of how hot a wood stove is going to get for cooking purposes. All right, so right now I want to give you guys some temperature readings. This stove has been burning for about 20 minutes now with a kindling fire. Um, I do have the damper control wide open for these first 20 minutes. After I take these temperature readings, I am going to narrow it down probably to more like the medium burn setting as I burn the remainder of my kindling down before I load my actual logs in. So temperature readings 10 minutes in. This cooktop is at 270 degrees. So people always ask me, like, can you cook on just a regular wood stove? And yes, absolutely. So the stove has been burning 20 minutes and your cooktop's already almost 300 degrees, which is basically a setting for like a low simmer on, you know, like a stew or something. Um, so you could absolutely fry bacon after the stove's been running for a while. And I'll give you temperature readings, like for the medium and the hot burn as we continue to go through. The back top plate here is going to be at 103 degrees on the left hand side and a little bit hotter, 114 on the right hand side when facing the front of the stove. So this little step up is going to create convection air. So um, having this flat cook surface and then adding this with two little air gaps is going to help create hot air and push it off the front of the stove to help push the heat around the house without actually having any type of blower system. So I am now about an hour into my medium burn. Um, I had loaded three smaller logs that were split, so it wasn't even really like one big, huge, huge round. Um, so again, this is my medium fire. So the stove has now been burning a total of about two hours. One hour to burn down my medium fire or my, my kindling, my small fire, and now an hour deep into my medium fire, I wanna give you guys some temperature readings. Center of the cook plate, we have 566 degrees. To the side, to the left-hand side is 426. To the right-hand side, we are at about 450. On the back plate here, we are at 235 degrees on the left side, 260 degrees over here on the right hand side. So this is kind of nice if you were cooking on this wood stove, you could definitely be like frying something here in the center um, and have kind of a lower simmer going on up here at the rear of the stove. So my stove has been burning for about six hours now, um, I am burning down through into my hottest burn right now. So I'm gonna give you guys some updated temperature readings. Top of the stove, we're at 589 degrees. Right hand side of the stove is 505. Left hand side is sitting about 525. Top rear of the stove, 335 on the left hand side, 325 also on the right hand side. If you guys find my videos helpful, if you enjoy the information, if you enjoy watching me, please don't forget, give me a quick little thumbs up. Don't forget to click the subscribe button in the corner of the channel. That helps me out so much. Sharing my content with a friend really helps boost it. The more likes, the more subscribers we get, the more videos I will make for you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Have a wonderful day.